Welcome to ComWeb's video tutorial series. This video tutorial will discuss the user registration process. If you have additional questions, please feel free to contact ComWeb support at support at comwebinc.net. You've heard about it and now you've checked it out and seen your website. But now you need to join up with your community to get all the latest information. This is your drop down welcome menu. You can log in here and you can register for the site or you can also click on the login link. Open your drop down menu and click on register. The system will take you through a registration process. You will need to enter your email address and click on the submit button. This allows the system to try and match up your email address with one that's been previously uploaded. If you don't know or don't think you got an email, but your record's already in the system, you can go ahead and have the link sent to you again. And please check your spam box if you think you've never gotten a copy. Sometimes they end up in there. Or you read the email and you know your PIN code assigned to your account. You can check that choice. So for this example being super awesome, let's pretend I know my PIN code and click on that button. Now enter your registration PIN code and click on Submit. If you don't know your code, you may request a new one. The site's Terms of Use page will be displayed. After you've read it, you need to enter your street address number. If mine was 567 Alphabet Avenue, then I would enter 567 in the field. Then I need to agree to the Terms of Use. Now confirm your account information and choose a username for the site and a password. A username is going to be what's displayed when you click on the welcome drop down menu button. Now you're able to edit your member record. Go ahead and fill out the information in the fields. The system will store it for you. If you want to mark your information private and so it will not be displayed in the member directory, you can by checking on the mark private box. In the Personal Web Information tab, you can select subscriptions you would like to receive from the site. You can also change your password and view the last time you were online. Want to add a photo and make your profile more recognizable? Click on the photo box to open it. You can upload a photo from your local hard drive by clicking on the Browse button. Find the photo you want to use and click on the Upload and Edit button. Resize it to fit into the grayish box area by dragging the corners around and click on Submit when it's just right. Did you know that your drop down welcome menu also has links to update your profile, change your password, edit subscriptions, or take you straight to the billing area if you're currently using one, and of course, have access to the ComWeb help documentation area. The user help documentation is a tool to help you use the features and modules of your website. Now you know how to register for your website and how to use the drop down welcome menu.